All right, guys, I got a very special guest here with me. This guy right here, that's my dad, okay? You guys have seen him before in videos. Uh, <laughs> you guys have seen him before uh, in some of the explanations and the strategies that I talk about. You guys know that I run his social media. Um, and um, I wanted to, exactly, Cody, uh, hashtag module Thursday, that's right. I wanted to uh, basically bring him in uh, today. He, he's actually from Puerto Rico and he's visiting me for a couple of days. We have a special family event here on this weekend. Uh, but I wanted to bring him in uh, because uh, it's kind of like an, uh, on an interview mode. For the last week that you guys did module uh, three and four, there's been a lot of questions on the subject of content creation. How do I do this? A lot of you guys have been amazing and uh, like Corey and uh, um, a bunch of you guys have actually posted some videos uh, producing content and uh, you, some of you guys have been like trying to picture how to go ahead and create content for your brand, for your products, for your service and how to make a difference in the world. So I wanted to have him talk about that. In case you guys don't know, this guy right here is a YouTube star and a Facebook star. He's generating right now over 20 million views on his channel a month. Uh, he's uh, actually uh, developing viral content every single week that is going viral like crazy um, with a strategy that we came up with on the subject of positioning, which I talked to you guys about. And this is somebody that knows how to make a difference and how to produce content. So, Dad, um, you wanna tell my students, this is like, all, these guys are like awesome entrepreneurs that are investing a lot of energy to get good at this uh, and building their brands and trying to make a difference. And they want to go uh, on a similar route to what you have done in building this international monster. Uh, anything you want to say to them on the subject of content creation and how you have made it a mission for yourself to help people in the world? Well, uh, I can share with you that uh, I have uh, discovered uh, a good part with Manuel's help uh, that uh, it's all about attention. <laughs> uh, when you want to have a successful business, a successful future, when you want to have stability, when you have, want to have abundance, uh, no scarcity of customers or prospects, whatever, you need to call attention. Now, uh, there's two ways to call attention. There's uh, good attention and attention that's bad attention. You want good attention. You want an attention that's, uh, that's to the things that you're expressing that have some value to your uh, potential customers. You have to think in terms of them. You can't think of you, you have to think of them. My most successful action, and I have something like 20 million uh, videos seen per month on my YouTube channel. It's in Spanish, my market is mostly the Latino market. Uh, it's called Metabolismo TV. Uh, it's, a, it's, a, it's a YouTube channel where we, uh, I teach people uh, what I know about health, about metabolism, about health conditions, about how to avoid medications and things like that. Uh, I, uh, I've, I uh, have continued uh, growing uh, followers. I have millions of followers, and these followers, I don't sell them anything. I actually never sell anything. I only give them education. Uh, I realized some time ago, which is something you guys uh, have to look at, that whatever you know, your prospect does not know. <laughs> whatever you know uh, that you think it's not interesting because you already know it. Uh, you take it for granted. You take it for granted. Yeah. There's a hell of a lot of people who want to know what you know. <laughs> uh, no matter what it is. No matter what it is. No matter how stupid or simple you think it is, it's actually very interesting to other people who don't know about it. Now, uh, the, 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 the formula here is the more you communicate, the more they will want to interact with you. The more you provide them with valuable information, the more valuable you will be to them. Uh, so in order for you to raise your own value, your own value of your products or your services, you have to be able to create content. You have to be able to provide them with uh, tips, with uh, even tell them about the mistakes that you've made in the past and what you learned from those. Without uh, asking for anything, right? You're not asking for anything. You just want to give them content. 
Now, in order to uh, give good content, all you need to have is the intention, the decision to actually communicate something that will be valuable. Uh, and uh, the other uh, fixed idea that some people have that don't know, does not allow them to actually create content is that they think they need a very high quality with makeup, with special lights, all of that is false. Uh, what you really need is just a subject, a subject that you're good at, a subject that I bet you the, the receiving person does not know enough. Uh, so, so you don't need to have uh, a special title, uh, a certificate, uh, a doctorate. Are you? On, on are anything. you? A, do you have a certificate, uh, or a doctor? I'm not a doctor. I'm, I'm not a, 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 a nutritionist. I'm none of those things. I am a very good student. I'm a goddamn good student. I study very well. Uh, I learn my things. I study medicine. I'm not a doctor. I'm not, I'm not even interested in being a doctor. So no university give you a certificate? No, 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 no. It, it's, all mm. about, it's all about knowing, knowledge. Knowledge is everything. You will hear Manuel say that all the time. Uh, if you don't have enough income, it's only because you don't have enough knowledge. That, that's, that's all it is, okay? It's just a simplicity. So I've made it a point to know my stuff. Uh, I, I can go through a, a medical... Uh, dictionary or a medical text or a clinical study or whatever and study that until I fully understand it to the point that sometimes doctors are threatened by my presence yeah. only because I know the stuff see I really studied it so now uh, you have a huge opportunity in this social media uh, time I'm, I'm 68 years old yeah so you're talking to people that so, uh, they know about knowledge they are interested in yeah. learning about it because they're here because they're paid students. So in, in my days, uh, I, I used to advertise on TV, on radio, newspapers, whatever. My friends, that's all gone. It's a waste of money. Uh, people's attention is here, okay? And, uh, and uh, I, I, if you want to attract attention, you have to go to here. This is where their attention is. You have to notice that if, uh, couples don't talk to each other anymore. You went to any restaurant, they're all looking, they're all Facebooking. Uh, so uh, you gotta go where the money is and the money is where the attention is. Uh, now, uh, when you want to create content, all you need is to decide to create content. For example, every single day, everything that I study or I learn that's interesting, uh, even some conversation that I had with a person who's making some mistake, if I correct that, uh, that mistake that they're making with their health or whatever, I always make a note here. I have a little notebook and I make a note of that here. And now I have a subject. Mm. Uh, so I keep accumulating subjects Good and tip. subjects and subjects and subjects. Anything that I see that could be interest, I can go into a restaurant. They serve me a plate. Uh, uh, there's some good food there and some that's not that good, I make a note, okay? Uh, now I got another subject. And so, so I keep adding subjects and I have a huge list of subjects. Life is so varied that whatever your specialty is, you can actually keep adding subjects. And then uh, every day I give them at least one video. Uh, in my case, I give one video a day. So let me ask you something. Is it possible that you ever run out of content? You cannot. You cannot. If you really uh, go deeply into your subject, it's impossible for you to go out of, uh, of content. Now, you have to really be observant of everything you do. Uh, it's sometimes easier to watch others than to watch yourself. <laughs> uh, but through the day, you're having conversations, you're making decisions, you're finding about new products, you're finding about your competition, you're finding about uh, things that are better in your product than your competition. You're finding about uh, new trends in the market. You're finding out so many things that your potential customer would be interested in knowing. The more that you show them that you know, the more trust they will have on you. Now, if you go and talk to two doctors and one of them uh, expresses a, a lot of knowingness, a lot of knowledge, uh, would you actually go with the other one uh, that didn't know how to answer your questions or didn't have any suggestions? You would always go with the one that looks like the more knowledgeable person, the one that has the most certainty. So it is a matter of living your life doing what you do, making notes of everything you discover, of every thought that you have, making notes, and then creating content. In order to create the content, you don't need a studio, 
you don't need uh, makeup. It's not about the quality. It's about the quantity. You need to give them quantity of good, honest, simple content that they can learn something about. Uh, uh, and, and then you keep putting it out there and it seems like nobody's listening. But let me tell you, I started doing that in February of 2011. I had nobody there. And I started filming myself and uh, putting it out there. Uh, and nobody knew what, who Frank Suarez was except me and some people in my little island of Puerto Rico. I, I knew what he, who he yeah, was. Yeah, so, That's but it. the rest of the world didn't know anything about me. How, so I, how many videos did you make until somebody started paying attention for real? Ah, uh, gosh. Uh, I think when I got to about 200, uh, 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 I, I started to notice it was really growing. And uh, these days we have about 1,400 videos. I do one every single day. Uh, but we have 20 million videos seen per month. Uh, we have uh, about 20 people, just uh, consultants of mine that I contract in other countries who are handling all of the interaction, all of the engagement. And then out of that engagement comes the uh, request for information on my products, on my services, on my clinics, on whatever. And that's how we make business. Uh, uh, so I don't sell anything, I just educate and I get people interested, and when I get people interested, they trust me, so whatever I say, they know it's true. I never yeah. give them anything that's untrue. Uh, I, I never boast about myself, but I always give them something that's practical, mm. something that they can use, yes. something that actually they can think with. Uh, and, and, and little by little, you keep adding people's attention, people's trust in you, and you will have more prospects than you can ever handle. That's the situation I'm in now. Now my problem is staffing, getting enough consultants to handle all of this demand because we have more demand than what we can handle. So it's not a problem of promoting. It's a pro Once you start creating good content, whatever content, it doesn't have to be long. It could be a minute long, two minutes long. It doesn't, it doesn't matter. As long as you're putting something out there that they do not know mm -hmm. that will make them interested, they will start trusting you, especially right. since you're not selling anything. But you're, you're opening up a communication line. Right. And they will want to interact with you and they will want to ask more. Or, or when they think of, oh, I, I would like to, I might need to buy a product like that. Whom should I call? Whom should I contact? I should contact that guy that's always putting those right. videos on that same subject, right. of course. But then, then you also have like marketing ninjas that start learning about how to continue totally. exactly. communicating totally. with those people that are seeing your videos. Totally. Right? Totally. So I would ask you, uh, you've been in business for how long in Natural Slim? Uh, it's been 20 years now. 20 yeah. years, yeah. okay. So um, what was the biggest platform that helped you get to the next level in your business in history? Oh, Advertising. Definitely uh, Facebook. I mean, nothing compares with that. I mean, I used to have a, for Puerto Rico alone, we were investing $65,000 uh, a month on TV in Puerto Rico. Uh, these days we do uh, 50 times more <laughs> in prospects and sales in eight different countries with about, uh, 18,000 a month. Wow. Uh, and we do, uh, we were servicing in those days, uh, 20 years ago, we were serving maybe uh, 300 people a week. These days we service 7,500 people a week. Thousands. In eight countries uh, with, with, a, with, a, with a minimum of investment. So, so don't waste any time with anything. Uh, Facebook is the means. Uh, your opportunity to do it is now. Uh, every year that goes by, Facebook is becoming a little bit more and more expensive. It has to be because more and more companies are joining in to do it. So don't, don't procrastinate. Don't waste time. You got your opportunity now. I mean, I mean, you got about two or three years to actually reap the benefits because the big companies are already jumping on it. And, right. Uh, and so, so if you're the first one to catch that attention, you will have the market. Okay? If you wait until the market develops for you, you're too late. <laughs> so, so start producing some uh, videos. Uh, of, 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 uh, uh, if you can do it nicely, great. But if not, just use your phone, uh, produce content, but get your message out. 
get your knowingness out. Make sure that you let them know that you know about your stuff, okay? And the only way you people know that you know about your stuff, or whatever you do, whatever service, whatever product, is for you to communicate. If you don't communicate, nothing will happen. So it's a matter of just deciding and putting the discipline in that every single day, you're gonna do some uh, video. See, in, in my, in my uh, pocket, I carry a little uh, microphone. This is about $19 in uh, in, uh, Amazon. See, this is my little microphone. Uh, it's a very long, 20 foot long uh, uh, cord. Uh, $19 in uh, Amazon. I, I buy this thing, I hook it up to my phone, and uh, I have somebody take the video these days, uh, but I do it out of my phone. And, uh, and I, I'm in communication with them, and they love it, and they and they interact, and they ask me about where can I buy the product, where can I, how can I get the service, how can I send my mother in, whatever. All you want is a communication, but give it to them, give them the content. So, so here's a question uh, for these guys that are having a difficulty getting started because it's too difficult. Does it get easier with time? Totally. It's it's like everything that you do in life. You know, the first time you try to drive a car. Uh, you're all upset and looking at the mirror, and uh, these days you drive the car and you don't even think about it. Uh, the first thing you try to uh, uh, brush your teeth, same thing. Uh, now you do it, you don't even think about it. Was so, it was it weird talking yeah, to a camera at first? It was weird, uh, 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 but it, it, I mean, after two, three days, four days, five days of doing it, uh, even if you make a mistake, it's not important. You see, people want uh, see when the public sees that everything is just too perfect, they almost always know it's false, see? So they want something organic. They want something that look real. They want you to look like them. So be so, you. So be you, and if you make a mistake, it says, oh, I'm sorry, I fucked up, okay? And, and then <laughs> explain it to them. That, that way you're real to them. So uh, I thought that it had to be perfect, and the lighting, and, the, and if I made a mistake, cut that in. Uh, not anymore. I do it naturally. I give them, like I talk to you, like I talk to anybody else that I meet on the street. And, and that's the way to go. It looks natural, it's organic, and people know it's true. They feel it's true. Why? Because if you make a mistake, you say, that was a mistake. I, 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 let me correct that, and that's it. See, And that's what they expect from you. If you give them very good, uh, constant, every day, every day, every day, every day communication, uh, nothing will stop you and your competition will be left in the dust. That's really what's going to happen. Key word here, persistence. Persistence, yeah. Persistence. Keep on going. Yeah. It's something that uh, gets better with time. And I can tell you that I've seen him grow. Uh, he's a true social media star. I happen to be really good. He was my guinea pig, right? Yeah. I learned everything that I know about I marketing. I survived him. I survived him. He yeah. survived with me. Yeah. Uh, Successfully, yeah. I became the marketer for his channels. Yeah. And uh, everything that I teach you guys uh, that you are learning on the course, uh, I originally learned getting his content out there. So we've had a good combination. So what do you guys have? You guys have what I know already. And... If you guys get this part, know how to produce content and keep on doing it consistently, Put it out there. Uh, you have the winning combination and there is nothing that anybody can compete with if you have that system down. So um, let me see if you guys have any questions. Anybody has any questions for, for Frank? Sharon says, hi dad. Yeah, this is my dad, okay? I'm the baby, there's four kids. Uh, <laughs> there's four kids and I'm the little one. Corey, who's, a, who's one of my great students, he says, Hola, padre, me gusta mucho. He's not Latin. Uh, no, no, he's speaking a little bit of Spanish there. Okay, okay, okay. Afina says, Suarez Power. That's right, Afina. Yeah. So anybody has any question, any quick question before we let you go for a real social media star right here, okay? okay? Uh, he can answer it for you guys because I know that I have a bunch of you guys that I've been asking questions about this whole content creation. What should I do? How should I do it? Does this work? Does this not work? Uh, what sh subject should I make it all about? And stuff like that. I think that you guys have a lot of valuable data from that already. And um, uh, Corey says, no, I'm a white boy. Boy, Yes, you are a white boy. Yeah, I know that about you already, Corey. Okay, good. So guys, um, there you have it. Module Thursday. Interview with my dad, great social media star, somebody that is getting it done. Um, you have a combination of power here. Uh, if you figure out how to do content, and now you're learning about distribution with the Facebook marketing course, 
then um, the sky is the limit. Okay, so great that grades on. Thank you, Daryl. Uh, Sharon says, I think I want to try it now, getting on the videos. Yes, good job, Sharon. That's awesome. Go do it. Go do it. It's all about that initial decision. That's how it all starts. All right, guys. I will see you Bye. soon. Have fun with Module 5.